rebooted. Bangonomics. Rebooted. Bangonomics. Rebooted. Bangonomics. Rebooted. Bangonomics. Rebooted. Bangonomics. Rebooted. Bangonomics. Welcome everybody to uh, another Bangatorial um, where uh, I'm in the oldest car in the car park as usual that often happens um, yeah I'm looking around and what do I see um, I don't see many very very old cars uh, or very well, I see lots of old people and uh, I'm an old person these days um, but the reason for doing this is that uh, I rashly um, asked um, people um, about me writing another book and I uh, offered a choice and uh, what people want is uh, a 1990s Bangopedia uh, which I'm happy to oblige it's a lot of bother <laughs> uh, for what you get back at the end of the day but I quite, I quite enjoy doing them and uh, it's quite educational uh, uh, in a way and uh, I get a lot of things wrong with it as well um, but people seem to like them, so that's good. So yeah, I'll uh, crack on at that. Um, but what I should have put at the front of this uh, video is uh, some a couple of old uh, uh, 90s bangers um, at my local garage. Um, the ZX that's there um, is the survivor of three that were loan cars. They've all done, you know, 300,000 miles of diesels. You can put anything in them and they will run. Uh, they, they are sort of ex-chip fat ones. Uh, that one, I think, that's there, um, he's recently pumped the tyres up, I did speak to him about it, and he wants to keep it because actually it's quite solid, it's not very rusty. Um, but there you have it, it's a, it's a car from the 90s which is pretty much indestructible, that you can put anything in and uh, will do quite a lot of miles to the gallon. Um, there's that old Volvo there as well, um, which is all you need in a great big estate. Um, and what it proves actually is that 90s cars were probably the last of the useful uh, fixable bangers um, but here in this car park that I'm in um, I don't seem to be able to find let me see no, I can't turn the thing around but there you go have a look around there there's a there's a 206 uh, Mondeo but apart from that everything's really recent I did go into a main car park just a short walk from here uh, and there was a Toyota Carina um, and also uh, a Subaru Forester from the 90s uh, but that was it really everything is uh, modern stuff so uh, yeah dream two car garage I suppose the uh, ZX and the Volvo uh, I think the Volvo might be a bit more further gone I've got to ask about that one whether he's going to keep it um, or not uh, not that I'm interested in that the ZX I'd be more interested in as a sort of a project to uh, uh, just run uh, in the end times that we're in uh, but there you go 1990s cars um, there's a Bangopedia coming and uh, yeah I was sort of signed up for that, so that would be a lot of hard work uh, in the coming months um, in my spare time when I'm not trying to earn a living like the rest of us. Um, but yeah, thank you very much for watching, like and subscribe and all that sort of stuff. And um, uh, I'll see you soon. And um, well, I might put a cover, a potential cover anyway, uh, of vehicles. And actually, if you have a 90s vehicle you want to be on the cover and you've got a nice side profile pic, I'll uh, put it in because uh, those ones are Nick from the interweb. But there you go, thank you very much, uh, and I'll see you soon. Bye bye. Rebooted Bangonomics. 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 Rebooted. Bangonomics, rebooted, Bangonomics, rebooted.